Hi everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. Come on in, come on in. You can have a quick chit chat with me as I try to make myself some. <laughs> not sure if you guys know or not, but I'm not really a good baker. I can cook, but I, I can't really bake anything. So today, um, I'm gonna attempt to make myself um, I like German chocolate cake, but I don't want a whole cake because it's just one person. So I'm like, oh, let me make some German chocolate cupcakes. So they're definitely not going to be from scratch because, like I say, I don't really know how to bake. So while I was at the store, I picked up um, this Betty Crocker. <laughs> it's a German chocolate um, German chocolate cake mix. I think it costs a dollar. So. This is what happens when you're in the house bored and you want to stay at home, uh, quarantine or whatever. I guess that's what we're still on. So um, I'm going to chit chat with you guys for a little bit and hang out with me while I'm attempting to make myself some German chocolate uh, cupcakes. Not sure how they're going to turn out. I'm actually also listening to, because um, I actually I'm here in uh, I'm here, I'm here in the state of Florida, but I, li I like to listen to um, old school music from Chicago because I'm actually from Chicago so I'm listening to iHeartRadio. I probably should turn this off just in case um um oh, let me get my silly just in case um YouTube decides not to <laughs> play my video so but I love this song right here so hope everybody's having a fun day Sunday hey What you guys know about joy and pain? <laughs> We're just gonna turn that down because I don't know about the copyright issues. I don't own the rights to this music. So what's going on on this Sunday fun day with you guys? I hope you guys are having a great, um, it is Memorial Day weekend. Let's see what this says. I actually want to um, send a shout out to all my um, people that was in the service um, to remember all those who, you know, gave their life and stuff like that. Cause I do have, um, I have family members that were in the, um, that were in the armed forces. Just want to send a shout out on this Memorial Day on this Sunday. So I, like I said, I decided to make myself some, um, I'm gonna have to pause this cause I don't know if I get, I don't want this video to get, um, you know, not played or whatever. But so let's see what it says here. It says one and one fourth cup of water one and I mean well, half a cup of vegetable oil and three eggs so I guess it's fairly simple we'll see <laughs> so I, I probably should get a bigger oh you know what I probably should get a bigger bowl let's let me get a bigger bowl oh uh, you know what now that bowl should be fine let me grab my my mixer I don't know what I was thinking I'm definitely not gonna mix this by hand so let me move my laptop I don't, I don't have to cut the music so let me try to have all this stuff uh, have all this stuff together this mixer is like fairly new because I rarely use it I think I just I don't even think I got work out of it. I'm probably Walmart or something. So we'll get that together. So it's time to mix it up. Hopefully it won't be too loud. So I'm gonna plug it, plug it in. Okay, so as I was saying, it is Memorial's Day. I hope you guys have a um hope you guys have an extra day off unless you are um, an essential worker and you actually have to go to work on a Monday on Memorial Day. Hope you get out early so you can enjoy your um, enjoy time with your friends and family at a social distance, of course. <laughs> but are people, are people actually even paying attention to the social distancing? Because I've seen, um, you know, a lot of people, the kids are graduating from high school, from college and middle school and stuff like that. And you really don't want your kids to miss out, you know, on that um on that experience so i just got some show you guys what i'm doing here i just got some eggs in here i'm probably doing this the wrong way like i say i'm not a real good baker so let's just 
what else I need in here? Oh, fourth a cup of water. Yeah, so I don't know if people are really doing the, uh, really, are people really paying attention to the social, um, the social distance? And uh, I mean, are they staying, are they staying away? Or, you know, cause like I say, I've seen a lot of, um, it says one and one fourth cup. I've seen a lot of parties going on, you know, online and stuff like that. Where people are still, people are still, um, you know, spending, doing stuff for the kids for the, um, so it's a half a cup of vegetable oil. Let's see. Hope I, look, I hope I have enough vegetable oil in here. Yeah, so people are still, um, I thought I should mix this up a little bit. That's right. Let's see, look, look, we're going to see how this is going to turn out. Like I say, I'm not a real good baker. I'm actually, I hope I don't get a lot because I'm only making six. Um, six jumbo muffins. I really, I'm not really supposed to be eating any, but I'm gonna mix mix this up a little bit. little bit and just um yeah that's a lot of uh, that's a lot of mix that's a lot of oil so let's see i'm gonna make, make sure i scrape the some from alongside the i know this is gonna be this is way too much for um <laughs> this is gonna be way too much for six six cupcakes but i don't want to actually like i said i'm not even supposed to be eating cupcakes so i'm just uh I'm just gonna make six jumbo, and I'll probably just throw the rest of it away. I hate throwing food away, or I may, I may just make some cupcakes and what's today, Sunday, try to give them away to some. <laughs> together so yeah this is way it's way too much it's way too much for me like I say I'm only gonna make I'm gonna just try to make six uh, six jumbo um, uh, German chocolate cupcakes thanks guys for tuning in thanks guys for um, watching watching me here on this Sunday fun day make sure you guys give me the thumbs up and like also, uh, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel so you'll know when I'm doing more videos or posting more um, posting more videos. So yeah, as I was saying about the um, at, at the stay, um, you know, what's it, social distancing and staying at home and stuff like that. I think some people are paying attention to it. I think a lot of people um, are now, you know, since some of the stores open up, depending on what state you live in and stuff like that. A lot of people are just you know, doing their own thing, I guess. 
And it is, uh, like I said, today is the, is the holiday weekend. Tomorrow is uh, Memorial's Day, and there's a lot of people out that's hanging out with their family, um, you know, doing barbecues and, and family gatherings and stuff like that. Although it's a, you know, I've seen people, they do have like family over and stuff like that, but you know, people have their mask on, but I mean, what's the point? What's the point in coming over hanging out if you're gonna have the, you know, you're gonna have the mask on because you gotta take the mask off to eat. <laughs> you guys are sitting around the table, you gotta take the mask off to eat, right? So that is that. So I just wanted to have a quick, quick conversation with you guys while I was attempting to make myself. <laughs> these um german chocolate brownies like i said i just got the um betty crocker kind and also i have oh wait i have well this is the duncan Hines. so i just got the coconut pecan you know for the top so when they get done i guess i have to come back on to show you guys how it um how it looks afterwards but i just wanted to see how you guys were doing how you guys are coping or do you find yourself baking because like i said i went to um I had went to the store. I had went to the stores last week and I was looking for um I think I was looking for some cornmeal or flour or something. And every store I went to, the baking goods were were all gone. So apparently everybody's at home baking cookies and cakes. Like I am today apparently, because I'm bored. <laughs> and I wanted a I had a taste for some. Oh yeah, I got look at that. I got a whole bunch left and I'm only gonna make I hate throwing stuff away, so maybe I'll just make one pan or one, um, you know, one little round nine by inch, whatever it is, or um, just one of the little round pans, or cake pans, and just have a cake, I guess. I guess I can give it away <laughs> to somebody. So anyway, um, yeah, I already got my oven on, what is it? I think you're supposed to have the oven on 350. I already got my oven on 350, so that is how my cupcakes look. So I'm going to put them in the oven which is already preheated. So my oven is already preheated. Now let's see how many minutes. It says, um, well it says cupcakes. Hmm. The time is 14 to 19 minutes. So let's see. I'll just put it on, I'll just put it on 20 minutes cause I already had the oven on for other stuff i have other stuff in there so um let's see what am i gonna do with the rest of this uh cake mix <laughs> i don't want to make just a bunch of maybe i just finished making muffins yeah i'll just give them away yeah because like i said i hate throwing i hate throwing food away i'll give them to somebody maybe my neighbors <laughs> i think she has kids so maybe they, they might like german chocolate so Anyway, so yeah, I wanted to talk, finish talking to you guys about the, um, not sure if you guys seen my last video, not my last, but um, a video I posted about the HR, um, the HR, the House Resolution, HR 6666. If you guys don't know, please make sure that you look that up, get familiar with what's going on, because there's a lot of, it's a lot of stuff going on that we don't really, you know, we don't really know about. I know this is, um. A lot of times I talk about um, pop up, uh, some of my paparazzi stuff I do on here because I am a, um, um, I do sell paparazzi. I have a business. It is called Addie B's Bling. If you guys want to get some fabulous $5 jewelry, you can go over and check out my uh, my website um, at www.paparazziaccessories.com slash 339214. I'll probably put it here when I'm done with this video. So, uh, but I do, you know, I'm, I, I use this page for more than just, you know, talking about jewelry. I'll probably, you know, start talking about other stuff. So, that's unrelated to, but mostly, mostly it will be about, um, it will be about the um, business. But, you know, every now and then, I just like to put out some information just in case you guys don't know. You know, as I'm here baking my, <laughs> all these German chocolate cupcakes, and, and you know, I'm the only one person. So the, yeah, there's a, um, a house resolution that was, uh, that went into effect on May 1st. Um, it was by a congressman in Chicago, well, out of Chicago, his name is Bobby Rush. And what the bill, what they're trying to do, they're trying to get this bill passed into law, where it's dealing with the, um, you know, it's dealing with the, the coronavirus, it's dealing with the um, COVID-19, where 
they can, you know, if they if they suspect that someone has the, the coronavirus or symptoms or stuff like that, they can come into your house and, you know, take your temperature. And if they even feel led, they can actually even remove you. They can remove you or your kids or whoever they suspect that has the, um, whoever they suspect that has the coronavirus, they can actually, you know, remove you from the home. So what I did was I sent a, a um, look at all these cupcakes. <laughs> Put these in the oven too. So what I did, I sent a, um, I sent an email to my congressman, which here in my district in, um, I, think, I don't know, what, forget what district I'm in here in Florida, and his name is Gus, Gus Barakas, I think is, is what his name. So I sent a, I sent an email because I wanted to find out about the, um, you know, about the House resolution. Did he know anything about it? Was he in favor of it or whatever? And um, needless to say, I didn't get a response back through the email, but I did see on um, Facebook that he was on Facebook talking to other, um, he was on Facebook talking to other people about something about the um, unemployment and trial to file your unemployment. So I, sh I shot him a message about my email that I sent. And so he said, well, what was the email about? Because he didn't get it, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I just sent a, a, a whole bunch of questions <laughs> about the, the HR uh, 66666 House Resolution. Isn't that ironic, the, the number, right? <laughs> so he sends back, uh, I wanted to know if he was in favor of it, um, who's going to uh, put this $100 billion bill if it gets passed. Um, and I had a, a couple of more questions about it, you know. And the, the main questions I wanted to know, was he in favor of it, and how is this bill going to um, affect the people? Well, I already know how it's going to affect the people, but... Um, you know, was he in favor of it? So he sent back a, a just a little short response. Really didn't really didn't go into detail or anything like that. He just said that he didn't think the bill would get passed because of bipartisan. They didn't have bipartisan support, but so which means that both sides didn't agree on it. But my thing is, um, I don't know if they actually waiting for the bill to get passed because I know here in the state of Florida. In certain areas, they're already doing stuff like that. They are, they've already having um, meetings um, within the little towns or whatever. Like if you live in, uh, I think in Fort Lauderdale, which is Broward County, they are, um, I, don't, I don't live in Broward County. I think that's like, like I said, I think that's the Fort, Fort Lauderdale area and stuff like that. They're already having meetings, uh, council meetings, meetings with, you know, the big wigs of the, the city and stuff like that. They're already discussing this stuff. They're already discussing how they're going to um, implement it. And, and my thing is, oh, wait, isn't, aren't you guys supposed to wait until this actually becomes law? It becomes the bill get passed and stuff like that. But like I said, we're so sidetracked with other stuff. They just slide all this stuff in. So you guys might want to go and pay attention to that. You might want to look up. The HR six 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 House resolution and see what's going on. Um, you may contact your congressman or your your senator or whoever and ask them about this because this to me is um, is is going to be evasion of your privacy because if it becomes a law, um, you're not going to have a say so. You're not going to have a say so if someone knocks on your door and wants to come in and take your temperature and stuff like that. In and my thing is, how are they going to even know that you're sick? Where are they going to get this information from? So you guys uh, take a look at that. If you don't know who your uh, congressman is or your senator or something like that, you can just Google it. It'll ask you if you just put in um, who is my congressman or who is my senator. And it'll ask, it'll pull up a website and it'll just ask you your name, your address, and stuff like that and it'll you know give you a bunch of people who all the senators in the area and, and representatives and stuff like that so make sure you guys go over and check that out um and let me know you know let, let me know what you guys find out like i say they've they've already doing that in certain in certain cities i think like in um i want to say nashville i want to say nashville tennessee they're already going door to door as um testing people so you know what what are our rights what happens if you say no i don't want to get the task you know are they gonna uh, arrest you are they gonna you know drag you out the house kicking and screaming like we see that they're doing in um certain parts of uh certain parts of china so yeah we we need to find out what's going on um apparently 
the bill doesn't really even have to pass. Cause like I say, they've 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 already um, started to implement this in other part in other um, in other cities, and I'm not sure about here. Cause I am gonna send I am gonna send him a link to the uh, to the um, the town hall meeting that I seen, which was in like I say, which was in Broward County. Um, I'm out. I'm out right outside of Tampa, so I don't really live. In, I think Tampa is 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 Pinellas County, so they've already implemented that stuff in certain counties around. So why are they even you know pretending like they don't know about the? Um, they pretend like they they saying it's, it's not going to get bipartisan support. It's not going to um, pass as a bill. It's not going to become law. But apparently they don't need they don't need the law because they 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 are already doing this in certain you know in certain uh, states. So let me know what you guys think. That's um, that's my little chit chat today for cooking with Addie. I'll come back and let you guys know how my <laughs> how my um, how my German chocolate cupcakes turned out. I hope everybody is having a great. Um, Hope you guys are having a great Memorial Day weekend. Don't forget what Memorial Day is really about. Don't forget the servicemen and um, people like that who, um, you know, who protect the, you know, protect the country and stuff like that. So anyway, everybody have a safe, safe, safe Sunday. And what are you doing on this fun day Sunday? I'm going to finish cooking myself um, um, a meal. I think I have some, some barbecue ribs. <laughs> I have some barbecue ribs that I that I am cooking. So um, yeah, so that's what I'm doing on this Sunday fun day. Um, just wanted to to do a follow up about the um, HR six 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 house resolution. So if you guys, like I say, if you guys don't know, look it up. Make sure you um, make sure you ask your senators and your congressmen about that bill and if they are in favor of it. So yeah, because it is they they are trying to push it. Yeah, yeah, I guess they're trying to push it through to become a law, but apparently, like I say, it really doesn't need to get pushed through to become law because they're already implementing that, implemented in certain uh, certain cities and certain states. So let me know um, if you guys, is that happening in you guys' area or your neighborhood? And come Tuesday, I, I am going to send another email. Um, I, I am going to send another email to my congressman around here and say, well, Matter of fact, I might just call because you can call and you can actually set up an appointment to um, to meet with them face to face. But because of the coronavirus, um, I don't think the offices are, are open now, but you can contact them because most of them are on social media. Like I said, I contacted mine through the Messenger app on Facebook, although he didn't didn't really answer the questions that I asked him. He just, it was just gave me a little short answer about. Oh, he didn't think it'll get passed because um, they didn't have bipartisan bipartisan support. But he didn't answer the question: Was he in favor of it? If it does get passed, who's who's going to be on the hook for this hundred billion dollars that this bill is supposed to to come with, and you know stuff like that? So anyway, that's enough for me chit chatting about uh, cupcakes and politics. I will come back and talk to you guys later. Let you guys see how my cupcakes turned out. Everybody have a safe, uh, safe day, and I will talk to you later. Peace.